This is how to properly share a Zoom meeting link with a group of people so that you don't have to uh, get questions like, what's the passcode? Or uh, you don't have to let them into your waiting room. So when you're creating a Zoom meeting, um, I'm in the editing mode of an existing Zoom meeting, but you'll see these options even when you're creating a new Zoom meeting. Um, you will see the options under security for passcode or waiting room or require authentication to join. What I always do, for my group calls is I, I uncheck, I don't check these two waiting room or record because waiting room means I have to like each, as each person comes in, I have to like look at it and click on, click out their name and click ad admit. But if I've, you know, they're joining a course of mine where they have already paid for something or they signed up and they should just be able to get into the zoom without me approving every person. Then what, what, because you have to select one of these options, you can't just uncheck them all. And so you have to select, for example, passcode and the passcode doesn't matter. Okay. And in my experience, you just select whatever passcode you want um, because we'll be able to give them a zoom link that has the passcode already embedded. So uh, that's my recommendation. Just select the passcode. It doesn't matter what number it is. And then let's go ahead and click save. All right, I've gone, and, gone ahead and clicked save at the bottom of the screen. So what you need to do now is to give them the invite link. And thankfully there's already a copy of link there, but if you need to, if you're whatever thing you're in, you, can, you could just select this, copy it, okay? And you might say, George, how come the password here is not the same as the series of numbers that we saw in the previous screen? Don't worry, it's Zoom doing some technical, uh, you know, in, in encrypting of the password. I, I think it's so confusing why they do this because literally someone cannot type in this password and get into the Zoom meeting, but this link somehow works uh, to getting them in. So this, this invite link that has not only the, the, the meeting ID, as you can see, it's 813, da, 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 da. The meeting ID is embedded in the link, but also the, the Zoom encrypted password is also in there. And if you give them this link, whoever it is, doesn't matter who it is, you can give this to uh, 100 people and all 100 people can use the same link to get into Zoom without needing, the pa needing to type in a passcode or for you to approve each person uh, to get in. So I hope this is helpful. And... Uh, and any other <clears throat> related questions, you can chat below or any other tips for others using uh, Zoom, you can chat below as well. Thanks.